All right, well, a dark forecast for Black Friday. There's a brand new survey showing that people are planning to spend less during the holidays. Only 9% saying that they're going to spend more than last year. My next guest, though, not buying it. He says that Black Friday is not going to be a bleak Friday. Eric Best is CEO of Mercant Corp. Eric, what do you see that no one else apparently does? Well, I think the theme this year, Neil, is that value shopping is going to be driving the 2008 uh, retail holiday. Okay, so what does that mean in terms of what we can see that Friday after Thanksgiving? So, you know, October was a rough month, uh, no doubt about it, uh, with the, you know, the stock market uh, and uh, just the ongoing bad news uh, about the economy. What we're seeing, though, is that there is a silver lining, particularly for consumers and for those retailers that can dig deep, uh, you know, and, and get through this uh, period of time uh, on the basis of their margins and on their operational All right, so that benefits the low-cost guys, right? The Costco's, the yeah. Best Buy's, those, those ones, because they're the ones warning that we're not so sure it will be that way. Yeah, on the other hand, though, you're seeing third uh, quarter results from folks like Walmart and Gap that show that uh, with the right moves, uh, retailers can wet weather this storm, if you will. And, and it's good news for concern, consumers as well. Well, you know, Eric, I always think that the ones who are the most depressed are journalists, and they're not shopping. So it's a fairly safe to conclude that all journalists will not shop. Um, I'm not sure about everyone else. I'm not sure they share that dire view. Um, what do you think? Well, Mercent is in the business of helping retailers sell their products through partnerships with Amazon.com and eBay and other online destinations. And what we're seeing is that uh, retail transaction volumes are consistent with uh, the NRF's predictions from mid-year of 14 to 15 percent year-over-year online growth. Hmm. Now, that doesn't necessarily speak for the whole retail industry, um, but it's certainly good news. It's a, it's a, it's a bright spot, if you will. Uh, in the retail economy. And when, right. when we look at what this means for consumers, you don't have to pay full price this season. Coupons are prevalent. Uh, certainly retailers are promoting early sales pricing. If you're shopping online, you're not paying uh, tax, with All the right. exception of a few states you're now, right. Right. and so on. And so on. Uh, and, you know, processed meats, always big, every holiday. Uh, Eric Vest, thank you very much. Good seeing you. Thanks, Neil. Take care.